You're about to witness a seismic event. Three, two, one. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another action-packed episode of IHW Unstoppable right here on Fight TV. My name is the rock star Chris Cole, and this is my broadcast partner, Shano. I'm Shano. Sure. Ladies and gentlemen, we're also joined on commentary by our other broadcast colleague, Langel. Great to have Langel back. We love Langel. Absolutely. This episode is going to start hot. We have Shane Stevens the X-Dragon himself, and he is facing the high-flying Phantom. But here is the high-flying Fantana. He is the most exciting man here in Ice Duck today for this episode. And then we have Shane Stevens in the ring, and he is diabolical. And I, I don't even know how to call this. One of these two men is going to leave the victor with that winner's purse in what his pocket. What the hell happened to his other leg? What? No, well, it's that's the way his tights are, bud. Hey! Oh, thank God. Just so I'll give him an autograph after I'm done kicking his butt. <laughs> Fantana talk about getting an autograph or giving an autograph. My mistake. What's up? Knife edge chops by Shane Stevens to start this matchup. The speed of Fantana matched here by the speed of Shane Stevens. This is going to be an interesting matchup because we've got two of the physically smaller guys on the roster, but they're lightning quick and they match up well against each other. Beautiful knife edge chop by Shane Stevens. Yeah. The velocity of Fantana countered by the sneakosity of Shane Stevens. Ooh, I like that. And just to chime in for, just to agree with Brian here, I completely agree with you, man. The thing is, uh, Luchador and Martial Arts, for some reason, has this beautiful mix when it comes to matches. Just watch, you'll see what I'm saying. It's true. Yeah, they, they say styles make matches, and this is definitely two styles that mesh together well. Absolutely. Let's see who comes out on top. That's right. It, it's not a clash of styles. It's a tapestry of styles. There you go. Beautifully it, said, Shano. It, are you okay? What are you talking about? Don't worry about it, bud. Irish whip. Fantana hard into that turnbuckle. Here comes Shane Stevens. Back elbow by Fantana. Fantana, wow, launches his whole body in the corner. Big old kick to the noggin of Shane Stevens. The speed of Fantana is so crisp. Oh. Whoa! Double! I gotta Oops. admit, I gotta admit, that was amazing. To the guts of Shane Stevens. Goes for that lateral press. Two! Not enough. 
A little bit too close to the ropes for Ryan Dow to get in there quickly. Yeah, Fantana there, if you notice, he extended even higher than he was planning on hot, than, than he was originally planning to do. And he comes back and adds to the velocity and the impact on Shane Stevens' ribs. Oh, he misses I'm surprised that he's still moving. And then he missed the moonsault. Yeah, well, you can't all be winners. True that. Oh, up on the shoulders. Float over. Going for the O'Connor roll. He gets it. One. Two. No. Whoa, I thought he had it. I thought it was over. I bet you. It's him. They even farted a little. Wait a second. The match is over. That was a three. That was a three. That was a three for the O'Connor roll. I nailed it. I was right. The, the fart was justified, Shano. Man, you don't argue with toots. He's shaking hands, kissing babies, or shaking babies and kissing hands, whatever he's into. Ladies and gentlemen, Santana. We need to take another look at that. I don't think we have time. <laughs> I don't know. Who's editing it? Who's editing this one, Lancel? I don't know. I I got so many new roles now, I don't know what I'm doing. I thought you were losing weight. Why is he getting back in the ring? That did. Huh? That did. Okay. <laughs> Coming at you every Thursday, it's the podcast that constantly asks WTF. My name's Brian Landry. I'm the rockstar Chris Cole, daddy! And we are the hosts of What's the Finish, a maritime-produced podcast that covers music, sports, video games, and all things pop culture while counting down to the big finish, the biggest story of the week. Check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and iTunes. It's What's the Finish, available every Thursday. Let me tell you something, Angel daddy -o. Welcome back to IHW Unstoppable right here on Fight TV Fantana. Mad victory over Shane Stevens. Shane Stevens not too happy about that, but can't really blame him. He's not a good loser or a good winner for that matter. Or not a good person. That too. Greasy. Very. Mm -hmm. We've got another great match for you right now. We've got Jasmine Hawks coming at you all the way from cyberspace to take on Ali Zwicker. Let me tell you something. IHW Wrestling is the home of Maritime Women's Wrestling. And we're about to prove why we say that with this great match right now. There she is, Allie Zwicker, making her way to the ring. One of my favorite ladies on the roster right here. You probably see why. Making, making her way around the ringside area, taking on Jasmine Hawks as Jenna mentioned earlier from, from cyberspace. The interwebs, if you will. Yes, definitely. Well, let me tell you something. These two ladies are going to pull out all the stops because this is, IHW is a proving ground for women's wrestling. We are the home of women's wrestling here in the Maritimes. We're looking at this match from a lens of these people who do not have such an opportunity in another promotion as they get here in IHW. Very true. The interwebs, not just the lining of your swimming shorts. Thanks, Shano. The research that Shano puts in before he sits down here at the announce table, it is... I, I love it. I Let me love tell Shano. you, I read Goodnight Moon four times before we started this show. Now, Shano, did you read all of it? Well, I looked at the pictures. Fair enough. Collar and elbow lock up. Jasmine Hawks with the power. What power from Jasmine Hawks. She's Definitely the strongest lady on the roster right now. She is a force to be reckoned with. She is not impressed by Ali Zwicker. Ali Zwicker does have an experience advantage. I was, I was eating my pregame nachos before, oh, and I dropped a little bit of the, uh, the synthesized cheese on her boot. And let me tell you, she's a scary girl, too. You don't want to be on the bad side of Jasmine Hawks. On a, on, a, on a separate note, my email hasn't been working well since then either. Huh. I have no idea what any of those have in common, but let's continue. Well, I'm assuming since she lives in cyberspace, she can do something to my emails. She has your bank account information, Shano. Oh my god. 
Oh, go behind. Jasmine Hawks powering out of it. Oh, hits the ropes. Allie Zwicker off. Both women sizing each other up. Allie somehow takes down Jasmine. Full arm dragon twist. Nice and tight. Although you might want to work on that right arm, seeing that Jasmine has some of that K KT tape on her arm. Oh, Jasmine reverses it, doesn't even twist it. Doesn't need to, Rockstar. So strong she could rip it out of the socket pops, as is. Pops it, then locks it, and into that. Into that hammer lock in the back. Jasmine the talent. Hawks. Sorry, Rockstar, you go ahead. Jasmine Hawks asking what she says. Apparently it was, I need to lay down. She, yeah, she didn't like what she said, that's for sure. Go ahead, Jan uh, uh, Langel. Matt Pettifer in there checking on the status of that headlock. Ali Zwicker seems to be having trouble at the moment, Rockstar, but as we mentioned, Jasmine Hawks being one of the, if not the strongest uh, lady on the roster, this is kind of to be expected, right? Absolutely, Langel. At five foot eleven, she is a force to be reckoned with. The nice clean headlock, Ali Zwicker with some shots to the gut. Yeah, feeding her those midsection shots. Oh, knee to the midsection of Ali Zwicker. Locks it in tight. Look at that beautiful side headlock. Oh, oh, light shot to the guts, enough to throw her off guard, and oh my. Allie Zwicker down hard. That one hurt. Look at that. Grabbing the small of her back. Now going for a cover. With authority. Carrying around like she weighed nothing at all. Nothing at, at all. all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Jasmine Hawks targeting that lower back area. Oh, oh she takes better. a bow. Look at this. Showing some personality here, Jasmine Hawks. I'm loving it. Everything she's going after is that, that lower back area. Oh, no. foot to the throat. Choking her in the corner, taking full advantage of that five count. I wonder if she can smell any nacho cheese. I love you, Shano. She just knows it's not hers. All I'm saying, if I'm in there and there's like, you know, nacho cheese in my face and I can't breathe. Uh, that's locked in tight too, the pain on Zwicker's face. Allie Zwicker getting the fans behind her. Oh, nice. Bridges up. Jawbreaker. Jasmine Hawks all the way back. Allie Zwicker waiting for her opportunity. She sees the opening. Here she comes. Oh! takes down Jasmine Hawks with a clothesline. You don't see her taking off her feet that easy often. Picks her up. Trying to figure out what to do with her. Going for a suplex. And oh! It's oh! Not a lot there, but she got some of it. Almost looked like a snap brain buster. Gaetan Lantang there. Gaetan Lantang photography for all your photography needs. Especially if you need wrestling promo photos. Or other photography. Clothesline! Allie Zwicker down. Foot on the chest. That's it! Whoa! Amazing! Wow. I just can't imagine. It looked like Zwicker just gave up. Had enough of the pain. It's over. One, two, three. That was it. One, two, three. What you think of that, Langel? Welcome back to episode 13, buddy. Glad to be here. Yeah. We're all of you. Oh.
find myself sitting here and um, trying to evaluate what took place at the IHW uh, fight TV taping and um, the truth is I don't really know uh, what I did to cause all this. Um, I was just looking to celebrate a return with a, what I thought was a close and dear friend, uh, one of the best, if you will. And uh, I don't know if he thinks I was looking for any handouts uh, for a shot at my former television championship, but I wasn't. If you know anything about Chip Chambers, you know I haven't been handed anything in maritime wrestling. And I don't expect one now. But the reality is, you have my attention, Chris. You have all of it. And it's not fixated on a championship that, yes, I did walk away from. But the thing you need to realize is, I didn't drop the ball and you didn't pick it up. You never had the balls to run with it to begin with. And that's not my fault. Hey fans, we know you're on Twitter and you're on Facebook. You're on social media getting breaking news the minute it happens. Well, good news, so are we. Innovative Hybrid Wrestling has social media covered. We're on Facebook, we're on Twitter. We post everything you need to know about Innovative Hybrid Wrestling. So make sure you're following us so you're the first to get the inside scoop. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. Jasmine Hawks took that victory away from Ali Zwicker, but this, this is it. This is your main event, the IHW World Heavyweight Championship. Man, Titus put it on the line. My guy, Cowboy Mike Hughes, is gonna take that strap from around the waist of Titus. Guaranteed. Guaranteed? Guaranteed. Let's find out right now. Cowboy Mike Hughes. Not only from Stratford Prison Rider, but a true maritime legend. Mike Hughes, one of the very men you can say on this planet, has made a wrestling career around the world. Landon, uh, as, as I said, I know you have very strong feelings against Titus. I understand that. Rightfully so. He tried to do some serious damage to you. Um, you also, coming from the PI, you travel with Calvin Mike Hughes. Where you did this show. Uh, can you give us any insight on his strategy for winning the IHW Television Championship? I talked to Cowboy on the way over. We talked about what he did to a number of people on his roster. What did you mean? The Cowboy said that the reign of terror must end. Cowboy said that he has a plan. He really let me in on it. He said that he's psyched, he's ready, he's prepared ready to walk out tonight with the IHW Heavyweight title. And I said, that's all great for you, but make sure that you get a couple shots in for me. Absolutely. Ladies and gentlemen, that thunder can only mean one thing. Ladies and gentlemen, just calm down. Ladies and gentlemen, here he comes, the reigning, defending IHW Heavyweight Champion. 
he is the only champion in the Maritimes that defends his title to the caliber of opponents that he does. Ladies and gentlemen, no matter what you think of him, no matter how evil he is, with the music from Flea Market on the ground playing in the background, he is the IHW World Heavyweight Champion. Ladies and gentlemen, Titus. Last post predator. Soon to be former IHW Heavyweight Champion. While that may be true, while that may be true, Landjul, you can attest, he's one mean SOB, but he's stepping in there with a man who, when I signed him, guaranteed me he would take the gold from around Titus's waist. Titus, super dangerous, very, very methodical, sinister, evil. Mike Hughes, however, is no stranger to violence. This is truly anybody's game. I put my money on Mike Hughes. I'm going with Cowboy as well, but Titus turned his back on this company, Shano. I don't even know why nothing was done when he walked out in the best of seven series against Smash Wrestling. That should have been it for Titus at that point. When he turned his back on the company, that should have been it. That is it. That it would be foiled down to cowardice on IHW management at the time. Uh, not necessarily Shano. Shano makes matches. He does not fire people necessarily or fire people. But I can sign some folks. I can sign some folks. Wait, wait. you have a hell of a lot of balls to show your fans here tonight. And once I kick Cowboy's ass all over this arena and beat him in the middle of this ring, I'm going to drag you into this ring, put that chair on your head once again, and send Come you on. both. See what I put up with? Now, Langel, Langel, you cannot feed into it. He's trying to get your goat. He's trying to get you to stand up for yourself. You keep in mind that he is the East Coast Predator, and you're built like Slimer from Ghostbusters. Uh, shut up, Boxer. Listen, Langel, dude, you're, you're, you're the bigger and better man here. Maybe not bigger, but you're definitely the better man. He's just trying to get under your skin. Don't let him phase you, man. We're here with you. Let's rock and roll. Mike Hughes going to take the title off of him. We're both rooting for the same guy. And let me tell you, the reason I choose Mike Hughes not only is because I think he's going to win, but because I want him to do it for you, my man. Thank you, Shane. I, I appreciate that. I, unfortunately, as much as I would love Mike Hughes to win, I think Titus has too much to lose, and Titus is too diabolical to have his title taken away by Mike Hughes. He also, has beaten Hughes before, and he knows how to beat him again. Langell, it is not against you. It is just a fact. Titus is the East Coast Predator. He's held that title longer than anyone else ever in the history of IHW. He's up over 400 days as the IHW Heavyweight Champion. I can't see him losing at any time soon. I just want to put it on a side note, though, man. Slimer's a fan favorite. Bring the bell! The referee has called for the bell. We are underway. And, Langell, like, I don't mean to insult you with nope. the, the Slimer remark. I mean, Sh Shano's like a half-filled bag of milk. I look like a half-eaten sub sandwich. These two men are fighting machines. That's what they do. We talk, they fight. No, I... You're right, but a line, of milk. a line was crossed. Speaking of milk, does anybody have cookies? Nobody has cookies for the last time. Shana, I'm going I've to concessions. Got, I've got a question. Well, before you go, Shannon, i got a question. Yeah, yeah. Was Titus fine was Ty after? Uh, Langel, okay. Truthfully, no, there was, there was no fine. I fought for it. But you have to understand, man, I, I, I know... Months ago, you could see my frustration with IHW management. I fought for him to be fined. I truly think he should have been fined, but he was not. He was not fined. Okay, I just, I just wanted to know. I did, I did, I did everything in my power, and I was, uh, I don't know. I don't want to say dismissed, but I was more or less dismissed, pushed no, aside. I know you did your part, and I, I appreciate. I appreciate everything you've done, Shano. So thank you. Let, let, let's focus on this matchup, Rockstar. Let's. Uh... Oh, yeah. Cowboy Mike Hughes. Nice side headlock on Titus. Titus with the whip. Oh, Titus all the way down. Oh my God! Screw the cookies. I'm staying right here. 
Mike Hughes outweighs Titus by about 20 pounds. Probably about two inches in height. Tyler Mike Hughes, a force to be reckoned with, but he cannot take Titus lightly. Ty Titus will literally do anything to hang on to that ISW World Heavyweight Championship. Well, we've seen it already. Titus slowly making his way over here and then back down to the floor. Titus somehow sneaked the title back from Dick Durning after last after a few weeks ago. Dick Durning vows that he will come back and take that title from Titus. Titus says anytime, any place, anywhere, he says that he will continue to defend this title. He slipped in, slipped out, got a boom, kept the gold. Like I said, both men's shoulders were down. He went to management, managed to get his way again. ISW now under new management. Yeah, well, hopefully I can get a little more swing with the new IHW management. I did everything in my power for Dick Durning to, to retain that title. Yeah, they, uh... Cowboy oh, that was a tightest back elbow for Cross the elbow, misses. My goodness, Cowboy with a huge larry. Go ahead, Lando. I was going to say, the new management team, uh, they welcomed me back. And... Yeah, it's... Great, great to be here. We're so happy to have you back, Landro. I know you yeah. kind of had a you've had a rough run, buddy. But like I said, you know I've got your back, and we're all here. Well, I I, I definitely appreciate that, Shano, and I, I appreciate you too as well, Rocky. Thank, thank you, Angel. And in spite of the cuts that had to be made, there are some cuts financially that had to be made to a lot of the staff. Unfortunately, that's the way it goes, Landro. No, I. I, I totally understand. Totally understand. Here we go, both men. Looking like we're going to have a test of strength here. Whoa! Looking for that crack roll. Knuckle lock, but no. Titus with the boot in the gut. Forearm to the back boot. Oh, that was right to the kidney area. He's going to be peeing blood. Head to the corner. Oh, and another one right to that turnbuckle cover. It's the rock. Wow! Look at that! Oh, Scoop oh, oh, oh. huge slam by Cowboy Mike Hughes, showing that agility. What agility for a big man. Titus is oh. way to the outside, hits the ground hard. He's nimble for a borderline giant. Keep on him, Cowboy. Come on! Yeah, better for keeping him back. I don't know what that's all about. Let him go. His job is to stay, keep his... I understand he's doing his job, he Rockstar. To keep them in the I understand ring. that, but come on. It's for the world title. Titus gets away with everything. Let's just get it off him. Not off on him. On him. Huh? Oh, Titus pulls Cowboy out. Blocks that right hand and gives him one of his own. A beautiful knife edge shot by Cowboy Mike Hughes. Cowboy, looking for crowd approval. Oh. All the way into that office room. They said they'd be all over this arena, and here we go. Yeah, merchandise. Sandra and Steph up, they're back. Right next to Brad from the barber. Oh. Hair cutting needs. Cowboy went to visit with Brad for the tonight. It's looking good, too. Mm. Tight. Tight fade. Toy. Oh, oh. Looks like working in a bar, he wheels him across the tables. Headbutt! Oh, that's gonna take it out of both men. it off, though. Cowboy tough as nails. Titus rakes the eyes. Bradford just kind of trying to mind his own business. He's like, I got scissors. I don't want to stab anybody. That's understandable. No one wants to stab anybody. Titus probably does. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Oh. Friends of Hub City Productions. Look at that screen. Put in their paycheck. Very proud of it. Oh, trash can oh, oh, oh. Mike Hughes with the trash can. Oh! 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 Absolutely, the downside is both men can do serious damage. Oh, I'm, I'm well aware. 
Titus. They're coming this way. Uh, and it, oh, there we are. Wait a second. Oh, no! Titus with a shot to the face. Hey, Titus. Titus. Wait. No, 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 hey, 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 sit down, sit down, hey, sit down, don't hit your mic, please, please, sit down, no, you can't stop him, God, I can't believe Brian Mac Come on, Landro, Brian. get out of the way! Oh. No. Oh my goodness, he destroyed no. thousands of dollars oh. of equipment. Oh. You like Brian that? Landro. Oh. Titus, Landro! Landro, Landro just... come sit down! Get up here before you get hurt. What are you gonna do get until you crush this little lot? Stay away oh. from him, Landro. Sacred and holy. Look, Look man, we just got you back. Up. We don't want to lose you again. Come on, yeah, I know. Landro, you've got to come back up here. I... I get it! I get it! Oh, Titus. Titus throws Cowboy back in the ring. I'm sorry I have to call this match. Angel! Come back if you can. Come on! Two count, not enough from Titus, even though the, the destruction of Langel's laptop from the oh. head of Mike Hughes. That's so much money. It was a great deal. Langel! I have had yeah. enough. Lancel. I have had absolutely. You know what? I'm done. I'm no, done. Lancel, just. Lancel, relax. I, I know it's hard. They did. I. We're going to talk. I, I'll talk to ICW management for you. I'm right get, now, we have a match. This is for the ICW World Heavyweight Championship. Titus has crossed the line. I, I, I'll try my best to get you reimbursed, Lancel. I, I don't even know what to say, man. I'm sorry. All right, just, just call the match. I, 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 I can't, I can't deal with this. This is an unsafe work. No, oh, it's an unsafe work environment, Rockstar. This is ridiculous. Lang we're going to do our best. Right? I will, I will do my best to settle this with ISW management. I, I'm not going to let this stand. I'll do my All best. Right. All right. Titus with that reverse chin lock. Got it in locked in tight there. You can see the veins in, in the Cowboy's head. Langel, we're going, I, uh, seriously, we're going yeah. to do our best. All right, all right, you know what? Let's just focus on this match. We'll talk about it when we get off the air. But I, I have had enough. Langel, we're going to do our best. Okay, I, I get it. Let's focus on the match. Let's just... Focus on the match. I, I sent I, Angel, I, I, I sent a message already. I CC'd you on it. I sent you a message on iMessage. Chris, you gotta let it go. Wants us to move on. Let's move on. Stop focusing. There's gonna be a. He's upset enough. There's no reason to just focus. On it. I'm gonna do my best, Shano. I know. Well, kidding. me too. But like, we got a job to do at the same time. I am sorry, though. No, no, I. You know, what is you know, you know, you know, I, I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. I just, I can't. You guys got to forgive me. You, you got, you guys. Zaid is saying, "Let's hear it for me." Let's hear it for me. Fans out on their love of Mike Hughes. Fans in awe of what just happened to Brian Landry. I uh, rightfully so. Cowboy Mike Hughes crawling to the ropes. Titus, oh, stomped right to the ankle. That's the type of guy no. you're dealing with. That's what we were talking about earlier. That's who Titus yeah. is. He doesn't care about anybody but himself. He's going to do anything he can do to keep the title around his waist. No. Oh. Stop. Four no. Mike Hughes on his no. way back. Titus, no. no. Oh, Titus gets him off guard into the turnbuckle. Irish whip. Reversal by Hughes. Titus into the corner. Mike Hughes. Titus oh, knocks no. it up and over. Locks the right hand, one of his own. We all know I was rooting for him. No. We all know I was rooting 
for Cowboy before. I'm yeah. sure as hell we're going for now. Only a two, only a two out of boy. Cowboy Mike Hughes, 260 pounds, straight from that top row. Oh, sir, Langel's packing this stuff up. He's Lan gone. Langel, sit done. down. He's done for the night, man. I'm telling you. Why, 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 why? Why should I sit here and watch this? Regardless, you have a job to do. You are being paid to be here. You can't just leave. Am I going to get paid for the laptop? We're going to do our best, Langel. You know that. Worst case, dude, I'll do it like a GoFundMe or something. But that's fun. Yeah, it's fun. Titus with that first no. chin lock. Again, just wearing Cowboy Mike Hughes down. To the gut, double hex to the chest. Also, Cowboy my favorite rap song. Cover him, Cowboy. Come on. Come on, Mike. We're rooting for you, man. Do this one for Langel. Cover him, brother. Cowboy Mike Hughes, not enough in himself to cover Titus. Matt Pettifer. All said and done, these men have already gone through a war. And up to five. Looks like Cowboy is up. New Titus is up. Looks like they're both, both men on their feet at the same time here. Titus misses with the shot to the corner. Misses with misses the big knee. Huge area from Cowboy Mike Hughes. Mike Hughes coming out like a burn on fire. I'm owning it now. Huge forearm by PEI's own Cowboy Mike Hughes. Oh, wow, what a forearm to the side of the head. Irish whip. Titus in. Big slam. Not enough to take out the IHW heavyweight champ. Pettifer saying that was two. I was thinking it was a three myself, but he's the official. Calling for the Husey driver, this could be it. All your dreams about to come true. No, Titus, arms of his own. Titus with the Irish whip. Hughes, the oh. knee to the gut. Pump handle. This is for all the marbles. You know what, I don't even, I know this is for the IHW heavyweight title. I want, I want Cowboy to just injure Titus at the point. I, I want him to I Titus at the boot! No. Oh. Oh. Angel, it's not. Not enough you know, to take out Cowboy Mike Hughes. I know you're pissed, man, but like, you can't, you can't wish injury on people. This is their careers here we're talking about. I did six months of my career, Shano. I understand. I look, you look, if anyone has the right to say it, you do. I'm just saying. As much as I disagree with how Titus has been getting away with everything, I don't I don't wish that much ill will on the guy that I want to see him injure. Well, I just want to point out that I was out for six months, and you know who I heard from from my HW? Yeah. I heard from you, and I heard from Rockstar. Well, That's what love you for. I know, I appreciate that. And I love you guys too. But nobody in this new management team bothered. None of the boys in the back bothered. And now I'm now without a $3,000 laptop. Oh, Cowboy misses at the laptop. I don't know what to say. Like, I mean, things were crazy here, man. Like, like everything was a whirlwind. No, I, I, I get it. Maybe I'm just, I just need to calm down. I want you to understand too, like we're not we're not making excuses, but I mean like the people who matter contacted you. No, that's you know. That they do. We're, we're, we're happy you're back, we're glad to have you. No one wants to see you. You know, like you know, I, was, I was devastated while you were out, but Oh the predators are oh, oh my god! god. He didn't see it happen, he cannot prove it! 
Therefore, no disqualification. He's got green sludge all over his face, Rock. It doesn't matter. You cannot say guaranteed that Titus did that. We saw it. Matt Pettifer did not. Titus taking out under the wing. Come on. That's on. That's the chair. That's the chair. Do something. What do you want us to do? All I can do is make the matches, brother. Come on! We got rid of one turd burglar. We can't get rid of both of them. They're good drugs. Oh. Where's the... Uh, Titus gets himself I, disqualified to hold on to the ISW. Heavyweight championship cannot change hands on a disqualification. He I, I, that I, shit. I got it. Lanchel, get back here. Can you hear me? We know, we know you're upset. Lanchel! Did you hear Shane? No. Oh, here come the people from the back. Oh. Let me tell you. McKay, Randy Petit, Titus fighting them off. You cannot take that away from him. Brian, Brian Lanchel getting these guys from the back. Good job, Lanchel. Lanchel. Although, I mean, somebody had to himself and he's right there. Oh. Oh. Get himself hurt. Mike Hughes. Just stay out of the ring, man. Just Mike Hughes around. finally getting Titus. What's he doing? Oh, oh sure. Oh. Oh. Match is already over. Mike Hughes calling for the Hughesy driver. Oh, no. Titus. Yeah, run. Right. Run. Of course he, of course he runs. As much as I, I love Langley, he's down there at ringside, but he's not exactly going stay after away Titus. Yeah, we'll stay away from him. Last, we saw what happened the last time he was in the ring with him. We don't need that again. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know what else to say. It speaks, the scene speaks for itself. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is the rock star Chris Gall. Shano, Langell, holy crow, we're gonna go back, all the way back to the IHW studio. I came for a title. I came for another belt. 
do it now. So you, in the IXW office, pick whatever you want. Hardcore, chain match, no DQ, two out of three falls. I don't care what it is, but I just want to sit here till there's one man standing. No DQs. What do you say, Moncton? Titus. He didn't make it to free, buddy. Titus stole another title win. Not only that, destroying Brian Langell's laptop. Uh, in a, I guess for some reason Titus wants, re wants revenge for... I don't even know. Cowboy Mike Hughes, not your IHW champion. Titus retains, Shano. Yep. I was wrong. Surprise. <laughs> You can find him on social media, Radio Shano, me at RS Chris Cole, you can find Langel at Langel. IHW, IHW Wrestling on all of the social media platforms. And don't forget IHW.ca and Eventbrite.ca for your ticket information. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in to IHW Unstoppable on Fight. I'm Shano. We'll see you next week.
making a way to never come back Can't extinguish your lasting light the Battle was fought hard We were with you We were all in for the fight The only real Rock star to me Have a tricks on ice for you Your spirit will never leave Never forget you I Miss you do So it seems like a horrible dream I never get the rub Overwhelmed by your endless Try to be Made it to the tea room At the China Club Back up to your feet Force yourself to Stand on your own You always let us help you cheat The only real Rock star to me Have a drink on us Man, I'm so glad today is almost over. Ten more minutes, man. Weird yeah. people today. Yeah, man. Weird people for sure. Man, check this guy out. <laughs> is it Halloween already? No, man. That's next week's skit. Oh, yeah, right. What's cracking, fellas? Hey, man. Can I help you today? Let me tell you something, fellas. Next week, I got punched so hard, I went back in time and forgot everything about who I is. Anyway, I picked up one of them new Blue Nui players. You mean Blu-ray player? Not in my house tonight. Anyway, you got any of them Blu-rays? Yeah, man, they're right over there. Hey, man, can I have fun in it? Hey, man, did you just David Copper feel me? What? No, man, I was just putting Blu-rays back. And I think you meant David Copperfield. 
I know what you're saying, man. Who dinky? Hey, man. You got any Blu-rays? Dude, you have some in your hand right now. Whoa! Did you just Chris Angle me? I think you mean Chris Angel. I know what you're saying, man. David Blaine. What's this guy's deal? Hey man, they're right in front of you, man. Nah, every time I look at this painting, it's making a different face. Dude, that's a mirror. Huh? Parlor Bond, your money's waiting. Anyway, fellas, I'm gonna go mess with some cavemen. Peace.